I'm Jason Hag. I'm here for Fight Ontario with the winner here, Urgis the Rhino Segeta. Urgis, talk to us about this fight. A very impressive performance on your behalf. Yeah, it was a good fight. You know, Smith Emerson is a very tough opponent. You know, uh, I give him all the credit. I was, I gave him my all, and he stood, he stood in there, and he just he wanted a banging. You know, I was trying to be more composed and then, and uh, and and keep my hands up and be more elusive, but uh, second third round I got a little more tired, but I still try to keep it in there and. Uh, use my hands more because uh, he was very strong, very game, and, uh, you know, ready as always. Now, Urgis, you know, Smith MSL comes in here kind of on short. Now, you were supposed to have another opponent. Did that change in opponent really mess with your game plan going into, the, into BTC3? No, not really. Uh, I This happens to me so many times that for me, it's like, oh, it's another person. Let me just... So I, I what I do is, uh, in my camps now, I really focus on my improvements more than my uh, what my opponent, you know, uh, has because uh, of so many people falling out, I tend to just uh, I, I focus on my holes and my like for this fight, I'm going to be working a lot on on what I've done wrong. And work on that. How much of a mental aspect is that for you, where you know a opponent drops out or a fight doesn't happen? But at least you got to fight today here at BTC3. Oh, it was good, man. You know, it was a good experience. One of my uh, one of my best experiences. You know, especially because I do. I never. I'm 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 not a home crowd guy. I'm a road warrior. I'm a. I fight at a, a way a lot, right? So for me, getting the, the crowd and my support, it was very nice. It was a really solid feeling, you know, and I was just, I was I, really, I was happy with the old experience and happy with the performance, even though I could have done better. I'm happy overall with uh, with what I did, and my goal was to win, and I got my hand raised, so I can't complain. No, you absolutely can't, and going into today here at BTC3, Urges, uh, Robin Black, the famed mixed martial arts analyst, he, one of his fights he was looking forward to was you. Obviously, he's not here, but what does that mean to you to get, you know, much love for your strong ground game from someone like Robin Black. It's you know what it felt really good and it felt great and uh, I think a lot because of that shout out a lot of people expect my grappling where I was able to use my hands a lot but it felt it felt good like in general it felt like it, the whole thing the whole experience felt really good and I, I can't complain at all and yeah so Urgis what's next for you obviously now moving up to two and zero as a pro uh, you obviously are the Rhino you're on the war path yeah um, I got uh, I got. I got stuff coming up. I got a fight August 2nd. Not really going to say where and when, but I'll, I'll, all there is is I got a fight August 2nd. I'll post it soon. It's a big fight for me. It's some big news, and this was, uh, I'm very excited that I got this win to carry on the momentum. And Urgis, for people that want to keep track of what you're doing on social media, where can they find you and follow you? Uh, my Instagram is Urgis Segeta, just uh, my uh, full name, E-R-G-Y-S-S-I-G-E-T-A. Hard to spell, so that's why I just said it. But yeah, that's my uh, Instagram uh, account. So yeah, if you guys want to follow me there, you can. All right, Urgis, congrats on the win, and enjoy the rest of your evening. Thanks, man. Thank you. I mean... All right. Thank you very much, Urgis. Thanks,